My beloved child, as the author of all existence, I speak to you now with boundless love and tender care. Today marks a profound moment in the grand narrative of your life, the final chapter of your earthly journey. But do not be afraid, for this ending heralds a beautiful new beginning beyond your wildest dreams. I have watched over you from the very moment I knit you together in your mother's womb. Every breath, every heartbeat, every step of your path has been precious to me. I have delighted in your joys, comforted you in your sorrows, and guided you through both sunshine and storm. Now, as this day unfolds, your last day in this temporal realm, I long for you to experience it fully, embracing every moment with a heart overflowing with love and a spirit anchored in my perfect peace. Remember, my child, that I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. Your story has always been part of my greater story, a love story written across eternity. This final chapter is not truly an end, but a transition. It is the doorway through which you will step from faith into sight, from the shadowlands into the brilliance of my unfiltered presence. Today, I invite you to reflect on the tapestry of your life. See how I have woven golden threads of grace through every season. Recall the times when you felt my presence most strongly, in answered prayers, in unexpected blessings, in the comfort of my word. Remember too the challenges you faced, for it was in those valleys that you learned to lean on me most fully. Each trial and triumph has shaped you, preparing you for this very day and for the glorious eternity that awaits. As you wake to this final sunrise, know that I am nearer to you than your very breath. Feel my love surrounding you, a warm embrace that will carry you through every moment. Let my peace, which surpasses all understanding, fill your heart and quiet any lingering fears. For I promise you, my precious one, that what lies ahead is far greater than anything you leave behind. Today is a day to love deeply and fully. Reach out to those around you with the compassion and kindness that flows from my heart through yours. Let forgiveness flow freely, both given and received. Speak words of blessing and encouragement to all you encounter. In doing so, you reflect my nature and leave a legacy of love that will echo into eternity. As you move through these hours, be fully present in each moment. Savor the simple joys, the taste of your favorite food, the sound of laughter, the beauty of nature. Let gratitude well up within you for the gift of life itself and for the countless blessings I have poured out upon you. Even in the ordinary, see the extraordinary, for I am present in all things, revealing my glory to eyes of faith. Remember, my child, that you are never alone. I am with you always, just as I promised. My Holy Spirit dwells within you, comforting, guiding, sir, and empowering you until the very last breath. Lean into this divine presence. Listen for my still, small voice speaking words of love and assurance to your heart. In moments of uncertainty or weakness, draw strength from me, for my power is made perfect in your weakness. As the day progresses, you may feel a mix of emotions, joy and sorrow, anticipation and nostalgia. This is natural, my beloved, I created you with the capacity to feel deeply, and each emotion is a thread in the rich tapestry of your humanity. Bring all these feelings to me. Pour out your heart in prayer, knowing that I hear every word, spoken and unspoken. I understand your heart completely, and I hold each tear as precious. Remember the promise I have given you, that I go to prepare a place for you, and that I will come again to receive you to myself. This promise finds its fulfillment today. The home I have prepared for you is beyond anything you can imagine, a place of indescribable beauty, unending joy, and perfect communion with me. Every longing of your heart will be satisfied in my presence. As you prepare for this transition, clothe yourself in the full armor I have provided, put on the belt of truth, grounding yourself in the unshakable reality of my word. Secure the breastplate of righteousness, not your own righteousness, but the perfect righteousness of Christ which I have freely given you. Let your feet be fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace. 
for you carry this message of hope with you even now. Take up the shield of faith, extinguishing any final darts of doubt or fear the enemy may hurl your way. Place the helmet of salvation firmly on your head, your mind protected and renewed by the assurance of your eternal security in me. And grasp the sword of the Spirit, which is my word. Let the promises you have hidden in your heart strengthen and comfort you in these final hours. Reflect on the good fight you have fought, the race you have run, the faith you have kept. Though your journey has not been perfect, you have persevered. You have grown in grace and in the knowledge of my Son, Jesus Christ. You have borne fruit that will last into eternity. Be assured that I am well pleased with you, my faithful servant. The words you long to hear await you. Well done, good and faithful servant. Enter into the joy of your master. As the day progresses, you may begin to feel the veil between worlds growing thin. Embrace this with peaceful anticipation. Just as a bride eagerly awaits the moment she will see her bridegroom, so your spirit yearns for the fullness of union with me. The best is truly yet to come. Remember, my beloved, that death has lost its sting. My son conquered the grave, shattering its power forever. For you, this transition is but falling asleep in this world and awakening in the next. It is stepping out of a shadow and into marvelous light. It is coming home to the place where you truly belong, where you will finally and fully be who I created you to be. In these final hours, listen closely. Can you hear the faint strains of heavenly music? Can you sense the gathering of unseen witnesses, the great cloud of saints who have gone before you, now cheering you on as you approach the finish line? They await you with joyful welcome, eager to embrace you in the communion of saints made perfect. As the sun begins its descent, marking the close of this final day, know that a far greater light awaits you. You will trade the light of this world for the radiance of my glory. No more will you see dimly as in a mirror, but you will behold me face to face. Every question will find its answer, every mystery its revelation in the light of my countenance. In these last moments, rest in my love. Let it wash over you like gentle waves, cleansing away any lingering regret or unspoken fear. My love for you is everlasting, unchanging, unshakable. It has sustained you throughout your earthly journey, and it will carry you across the threshold into eternity. As your breathing slows and your heartbeat gentles, know that you are enfolded in my embrace. The arms that were stretched wide on the cross to secure your salvation now draw you close in welcome. My beloved Son, Jesus, stands ready to present you to me, holy, blameless, and beyond reproach. And then, in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, you will be changed. Mortality will put on immortality. What is perishable will be clothed with the imperishable. You will step out of time and into eternity, out of the shadowlands and into the kingdom of everlasting light. Oh, the joy that awaits you. You will see my face and live. You will know as you are fully known. You will be reunited with loved ones who have gone before your relationships restored and perfected. You will join in the endless song of praise that echoes through heaven's halls. You will explore the wonders of the new heaven and new earth, forever free from pain, sorrow, and death. In my presence, you will find the fulfillment of every deep longing of your heart. The nagging emptiness that nothing in this world could fill will vanish in the completeness of my love. You will experience joy unspeakable and full of glory, peace that flows like a river, love that knows no bounds. You will take your place in the great ongoing story of redemption, playing your unique part in the eternal kingdom. The gifts and passions I placed within you will find their fullest expression as you serve me with unhindered devotion. You will reign with Christ, participating in ways you cannot yet imagine in the renewal of all things. So, my precious child, Embrace this day, your last day in this temporal realm, as the beautiful gift it is. Let it be filled with love freely given and received. Let my peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard your heart and mind. 
Walk through these final hours in the strength I provide. With hope anchored in the unshakable promises of my word, know that I am with you always, even to the end of the age and beyond. I will never leave you nor forsake you. My love for you is fiercer than death, stronger than the grave. Nothing in all creation can separate you from my love. As this chapter closes, rejoice in the knowledge that the most beautiful chapter is about to begin, a chapter without end, filled with unimaginable wonders and indescribable joy in my presence. Your faith will become sight. Your hopes will find their fulfillment. Your journey will reach its true beginning. Welcome home, my child. Welcome to life abundant and eternal. Welcome to the fullness of joy found in my presence, to the pleasures forevermore at my right hand. All of heaven rejoices as you enter into your reward. Rest now in my perfect love, my precious one. Close your eyes on this world, knowing that when you open them again, you will see me face to face. Let go of all that is passing away and reach out to receive all that I have prepared for you. The night is nearly over. The day is almost here. Behold, I am making all things new. Your new beginning awaits, more glorious than you can imagine. Come, enter into the joy of your Lord with eternal and unchanging love. Your Heavenly Father, my beloved child, as we near the close of this message, Know that every word is saturated with my deep, abiding love for you. This final day of your earthly life is a precious gift, a day to be embraced with gratitude, lived with intention, and concluded with peaceful anticipation. Remember that in Christ, you have already passed from death to life. This transition is not an ending, but a glorious beginning. It is the fulfillment of all I have promised the realization of the hope that has anchored your soul through every storm. As the moments of this day unfold, remain rooted in my love. Let it be the foundation upon which you stand, the lens through which you view every experience, the wellspring from which you draw strength. My love never fails, never gives up, never runs out. It is as vast as the heavens, as deep as the ocean, as steady as the mountains. Rest in this love, for it will carry you home. Walk through these hours with open hands and an open heart. Release anything that would hold you back. Regrets, unforgiveness, worldly attachments. Embrace instead the freedom that comes from knowing your true identity and eternal destiny in me. You are my beloved child, heir to all the riches of my kingdom, and your inheritance awaits. Let peace be your companion today. Not the fragile peace the world offers, but my peace, deep, abiding, unshakable. Let it guard your heart against any fear or anxiety. Let it smooth away the rough edges of emotion, bringing calm to your spirit as you prepare for this holy transition. Cherish each moment of this day as the gift it is. From the first light of dawn to the soft glow of sunset, see my hand at work in all things. Marvel at the intricate beauty of my creation delight in the warmth of human connection. Savor the simple pleasures I have given in all things, great and small. See reflections of my goodness and love. As your physical strength may begin to wane, lean into my everlasting arms. I will be your strength when you are weak, your courage when you falter, your comfort in every moment. Draw from the limitless resources of my grace, for my power is made perfect in your weakness. Listen for my voice today in the quiet moments. I am speaking words of love, assurance, and welcome to your heart. Tune out the noise of the world and incline your ear to my gentle whispers. Let my words be a balm to your soul, preparing you for the face-to-face -face communion that awaits as you interact with loved ones today. Let my love flow through you. Speak words of blessing and affirmation. Express the love that may have gone unspoken. Extend forgiveness where it is needed. Leave a legacy of grace that will continue to bear fruit long after you have entered my presence. Remember, my child, that your life has had profound purpose and meaning. Every act of kindness, every word of encouragement, 
Every choice to follow me has rippled out into eternity in ways you cannot yet see. Trust that I have used your life with all its joys and sorrows, triumphs and failures to weave a beautiful tapestry in my grand design. As the day progresses, you may feel the tug of two worlds, the seen and the unseen. This is natural, for you stand on the threshold of eternity. Do not be afraid of this transition, just as I have been with you in every step of your earthly journey. So I am with you now, guiding you home with tender care. Recall the promises of my word that have sustained you through the years. Let them be a strong tower, a sure foundation in these final hours. Remember that I am the resurrection and the life. Because I live, you also will live. Death is not your end, but your doorway to eternal life in all its fullness. As evening approaches, bringing with it the close of this final chapter, look forward with joyful anticipation to the dawn that awaits. A new day is coming, an eternal day unmarred by sin, unshadowed by sorrow, unending in its joy. The light of my glory will illuminate your path, and you will never walk in darkness again. In these last moments, rest in the finished work of Christ. His righteousness covers you completely. His sacrifice has secured your place in my presence forever. You approach me not in your own merit, but clothed in His perfection. Welcomed as a dearly loved child coming home at last. And so, my precious one, as you stand on the brink of eternity, know that all of heaven awaits you with joyful welcome. The angels prepare to sing. The saints gather to embrace you. My son stands ready to present you to me, holy and blameless in my sight. Take my hand now, my child. It's time to come home. Step out of the shadows and into my marvelous light. Leave behind the limitations of your earthly body and receive the glorious freedom of your heavenly one. Exchange your partial knowledge for the full revelation of my truth. As you cross this final threshold, hear my voice speaking the words your heart has longed to hear. Well done, good and faithful servant. Enter into the joy of your master. Feel the weight of my approval, the warmth of my embrace, the completeness of my love. Welcome home, my beloved. Welcome to life in all its fullness. Welcome to joy beyond measure. Peace beyond understanding. Love beyond imagining. Welcome to the place prepared for you since before the foundation of the world. Here, in my presence, you will find the answer to every question, the fulfillment of every longing, the healing of every hurt. Here, you will see my face and live. Here, you will know as you are fully known. Here, you will explore the infinite wonders of my kingdom for all eternity. So rest now, my precious child. Close your eyes on this world, knowing that when you open them again, you will see me face to face. Let go of all that is passing away and reach out to receive all that I have prepared for you. Your new beginning awaits, more glorious than you can imagine. Come. Enter into the joy of your Lord with eternal and unchanging love. Your Heavenly Father, my dear child, your super thanks fuels our mission to spread God's message of truth and enlightenment. Click the super thanks button to join us in shaping a brighter future for all. Receive boundless blessings in return, my dear child. Imagine that right now a powerful and loving force is shaping the future of your home. I feel your anxiety and your burning desire for a meaningful change deeply. Have faith and keep hope alive. The miracle for which you have prayed is closer than you think. This blessing is on its way to fill your home with joy and renewed energy. Wait patiently, for nothing can stop its arrival. I am here, strengthening you with these sacred words to increase your peace of mind, directly to your heart. I send promises that heal and soothe your soul. Indeed, it is I who approach, bringing peace and profound love. Every now and then, I send small signs to brighten your day and remind you of the constant presence of your Heavenly Father. But there are times when small signs are not enough. In those moments, I reach out to stroke your hair, 
envelop you in a true embrace and whisper powerful words that bring solace to your heart. I am with you every day. I hear your prayers and feel the anguish of your struggles because you are my beloved child. I know you intimately. I know your imperfections and have forgiven your mistakes. My child, click on the join button to join us as a cherished member of our community. Yet one area where you falter is in placing too much trust in others. Humans are fallible, they err and often deceive. Many are ensnared by the illusion of finding perfect companions who will offer unwavering loyalty and never disappoint. This is a perilous misconception. It is wonderful to love and trust, but elevate no one to a pedestal they do not deserve. Do not entrust your entire being to mere mortals, for they did not sacrifice themselves nor rise again for you as I have. Thus, guard your heart and trust sparingly, for even the most trustworthy may inadvertently cause pain. Remember my command, worship only the Lord your God and serve Him wholeheartedly with all your mind, soul, heart, and spirit. Love me deeply. This is the clear sign you've been awaiting. If you need further assurance, ask me and trust your life, your future, and your time to me. And I promise these gifts will be returned to you abundantly. I will envelop you in blessings and prosperity. Your fears will dissipate and your anxieties will vanish forever. Nights spent in worry will cease. Your sleep will be peaceful and restorative. When you pray, expect that I will answer with miraculous wonders that defy human explanation. This peace is for those who surrender their hearts to me unconditionally, pledging their unwavering loyalty. It is I, your holy and almighty God, who guards you each night. I remain constantly by your side to protect you and provide for your needs. My vigilance over you is ceaseless. Anticipate the arrival of great and marvelous blessings in your life. I am caring for your family, so do not lose heart. Remember, the most enduring and valuable blessings often take time to manifest. Everything has its appointed time under the heavens, a time to pray, a time to wait, and a time to celebrate with overwhelming joy and gratitude. On that day, the sun will rise and bathe you in its radiant light, signaling the arrival of the long-awaited miracle. But let your heart be joyful now. Leap with happiness. Draw on courage and strength, for your path continues, and many more miracles await. You will achieve tremendous victories and move from triumph to triumph, rising to new supernatural heights. From this day forward, know this, failure, defeat, fear, and humiliation are no longer part of your story. March forward as a valiant warrior, confident in your identity as a child of the Almighty God. I have bestowed upon you the power of life and death in your words. Use this divine gift to uplift, to heal, to bring hope to those drowning in spiritual desolation. Be bold and strive forward, for I am eager to bless you abundantly. Walk in humility on this journey. My children do not boast or engage in fruitless debates. They do not demean or discriminate, but view all with compassion. This is how my glory is revealed, not through arrogance, but through a heart that is loyal and true. I will work wonders within your family, your distant relatives, and your friends. But this requires your commitment, your vow to use the blessings, prosperity, and spiritual strength I provide to uplift, encourage, and assist those in need, both physically and spiritually. Let me know if you are ready to receive these blessings, or if you hesitate to embrace the path I have set before you. I offer you a journey filled with victories and provisions, but it demands your dedication to love and seek me daily in prayer with all your heart. Write this down and declare it. My God, I accept your blessings. Begin your day with peace and assurance. I am cloaking you in divine serenity for you are enveloped by my love this very moment. Leave behind your anxieties, I will handle them. If today you find yourself lost, anxious, weary, unsure of your next step or direction, pause and give me a moment. This isn't wasted time, it's essential for your well-being. Embrace the silence, feel my presence, recall my words, proclaim my promises, inhale the love that surrounds you, 
and sense my hand gently touching you. I will be there to hold you, to show you how precious you are to me, a sentiment that never wavers. I am constant, unchanging with the seasons. I will never abandon you. If you believe that I have forgiven your sins, if you are ready to let me erase your past and embrace a new beginning, if you accept the love of an eternal, all-powerful God, then the living promises in my word will manifest in your life. Believe in me, and from you will flow rivers of living water. Trust in me, and you will be endowed with the courage and power to overcome the darkness. Today, I wish for your day, and indeed your entire week and month, to be filled with joy and peace. Begin each morning with me in conversation and contemplation bringing forth your worries and celebrating your victories. Together, let's chart the course towards your dreams. Don't be too harsh on yourself. Your tension and unease do not reflect my intentions for you. You fear punishment, thinking I'm angered by your missteps. But remember, you are my cherished child. I want you to always hold on to the truths I place within your heart. Understand the power in my sacrifice the redemption and everlasting life birthed through my resurrection. From this moment, embrace a newfound confidence and love, perhaps deeper than any you felt before. Each morning, let us converse, and may you rise with a heart brimming with peace and faith. Believe in me, my child. Start your day knowing that all will be well, for I am ever watchful of your actions, and your kind heart will surely be blessed. To those visiting the doctor today, filled with apprehension, know that regardless of the outcomes, I am with you. I have not forsaken you. My authority is supreme, and my power to heal remains unchallenged. It is my desire to infuse your life with health and vitality, to replace your anxieties with divine peace. For those uncertain about providing for your children today, stretch your faith. I am preparing a feast for you and your family, a celebration of my provision in the face of those who doubt and deride your steadfast belief. Trust that I will meet all your needs, and your family will not suffer want again. Stand firm and fear not, for I am enriching your life. I am your sustainer, and you need rely on no one else. For those of you feeling burdened by debts and financial obligations, I bring you hope today. You are on the brink of receiving a surprise that will significantly alter your circumstances. To those actively seeking employment, continue with perseverance. Do not lose heart or cease your efforts. My angels are set to guide your steps, ensuring you do not falter, showing you which doors to approach, and helping you find favor in the eyes of those who can offer you opportunities. You will engage in work you never imagined, which will transform not only your own life but also the lives of your family members. You will joyfully fulfill your obligations to your creditors and find yourself in a position to assist others in need. Know that you are surrounded by a great community. I will prompt many among them to act on your behalf, aiding in your search for connections, companionship, and meaningful employment. Heed these words, I am your shepherd, you shall not want. Approach everyone with dignity and humility. Wear a smile even during times of internal strife, when tears seem nearer than laughter. I have endowed you with numerous gifts and talents, some yet to be discovered. Now is the time to unveil the full extent of my grace upon you, which will not only elevate your spirits, but also serve as a beacon for others to assist you just as you will brighten their days. A simple smile from you, my child can alter the course of someone else's day, someone who might also be grappling with their own trials and solitude. Remember, I am ever present with you, and this day will stand out as memorable in your journey. Continue to trust in my word, and soon you will approach me, brimming with joy for the abundance of blessings you will gather. Rise, my beloved, for today marks the beginning of new and marvelous blessings. Never forget that I am your shepherd. You shall want for nothing. I am your provider. Every deficiency in your life will soon be met. I am your healer. I envelop you in my love and grant you healing. 
I am your protector, under my wings. You will find refuge and peace in the shadow of my presence. My words are truth, and my promises are sure. Everything I have spoken to you, all the wonders I have pledged, will manifest. I am God, I do not lie. I will fulfill my assurances to you. I will guide you on the path I have crafted specifically for your journey. In every moment, through every circumstance, I am with you. No matter how daunting your challenges may seem, even when a miracle appears out of reach, trust in me completely. Surrender your daily plans to me. Prioritize me in all your endeavors. My presence will always accompany you, providing support even on your darkest days. When you feared your transgressions had severed our bond, when all seemed to turn against you, criticizing, hurting, and belittling you, wounding your spirit, speaking failure over your life, attempting to curse, destroy the, and rob you of your blessings. You felt crushed, near defeat. Yet, as always, I reached out with understanding, grace, love, forgiveness, and tenderness, lifting you from the depths of despair. Do not harbor doubts or lose courage. Declare with your voice that you will trust in me regardless of circumstances. You will triumph in all your endeavors for all time. I cherish you. Entrust this day to me and believe the doors will open. The storms will clear. The victory will be yours. And your blessing will arrive. Do not falter now. Persevere. I grant you the strength and wisdom needed to surmount this current trial. I will shelter you beneath my wings, out of the enemy's reach. I will elevate and console you with my love. When weariness overtakes you, I am here, infusing you with hope and encouragement, rejuvenating your spirit with energy and zest. I am prepared to transform your life. And that transformation begins now. Listen intently to my words, child. Even if you cannot see or understand it yet, you exist for a profound and vital purpose to realize the dreams I have envisioned for you and accomplish remarkable feats. You are not a mere happenstance of fate. I intentionally crafted you with a specific plan in mind. You are here to be a wellspring of blessings, not just for yourself, but for everyone around you. Elevate your faith and lift up your head. I long to see your smile. Reflect on the times you doubted your strength, yet here you stand today, enriched with wisdom, resilience, and intelligence. I chose you, my child, fully aware of your imperfections and moments of forgetfulness about my constant presence. I chose you to thrive, to be esteemed, prosperous, and content, so you can sow seeds of love and harvest abundant joy and wealth. I have bestowed upon you gifts of love, forgiveness, and service. Show the world my compassion through your deeds. Let your actions touch numerous lives and hearts. I'm enhancing your faith to unprecedented heights. And if it's necessary for me to visit you daily to remind you to focus on me, I will do so in countless ways to manifest my will and guidance. Do not fear, for I am your support. Do not lose heart, for my love envelops you. Trust in me. Press onward. For I am with you, and gather your strength, beloved child. In these moments of sorrow, look up to the heavens. There's no need to conceal your tears. I understand every ache within your heart. I cradle you in my embrace. Do not fear. I am here to raise you up, to purify you from your missteps, to transform your existence, to provide the solace and tenderness you seek. Allow your tears to flow as you feel my genuine embrace enveloping you. Know the depth of my love. I desire to alleviate your suffering permanently. Your journey has been arduous. I acknowledge that. I listen when you speak to me, and I perceive even those silent words mingled with your tears. I comprehend your emotions, your trials. You felt so undervalued that it seemed your worth had vanished. But remember, you are invaluable in my eyes. 
Listen closely to what I have to tell you, for my words are filled with immense love. You hold immeasurable value to me. The greatest sacrifice ever known was made out of love for you. Through my sacrifice, your guilt has been washed away, your regrets removed. You no longer need to bear these burdens. Those who underestimate you are deeply mistaken. Please forgive them and hand over to me your anger, sadness, frustration, and all those heavy emotions burdening your heart. It's time for you to forgive yourself as well. I have already forgiven you. Let peace flood your heart. Give me those heavy burdens. I have erased your mistakes, and you need not carry them any longer. I love you deeply, child, and I desire for you to live a life filled with victories. Therefore, I encourage you to wake today with a new perspective. I am granting you the sensitivity to recognize how blessed you truly are. The more you open your eyes, the more blessings you will see, and the more gratitude will fill your heart. Your praise is a melody that resonates through the heavens. Your worship opens the doors to blessings, abundance, health, and true prosperity. Take my hand. Share with me your heartache. Are you feeling sorrow? I understand you. I feel your pain. The silent agony you endure tears at you from within. Your soul cries tears of blood for broken promises, unfulfilled dreams, and lost love that never returned. Your sadness overwhelms. I do not wish for you to continue this way. You've allowed others to diminish your dignity and worth. Just give me a moment of your time and let me share my heart with you. Here you are, enveloped in the mantle of my love, cradled in my peace, forever in my heart. Remember, no one can ever remove you from my side or cause me to look away from you. You are my cherished child. Why do you tremble? Why do you weep? Why do you dwell on the past or worry about what surrounds you? When before you lies your true dreams and the joy you've long sought, all is secured for you. I've promised you this many times, but your role is to believe, to silence the lying voices of those who envy you and aim to steal the blessing they will never receive because they have rejected the truth. Hear these words deeply, for they are wrapped in unwavering love and truth. You have trusted in me, dedicated your life to my will, and in return, I promise to enrich you beyond measure. You will forever dwell safely, enshrouded in my peace, embraced by my love. From this moment forward, close your ears to those who doubt your capabilities or question your worth. They lack understanding of my boundless love and the extent of my power. I am the almighty creator of all, and for me, nothing is impossible. Now bow your head and with all sincerity, give thanks to your Heavenly Father for the gifts of love, salvation, security, protection, comfort, wisdom, and healing bestowed upon you. Acknowledge the blessings you've received and anticipate those yet to come. Invite me into your heart. Open your home to my presence and speak my name in every conversation. Recall my promises and proclaim them loudly. Remember, the heavens have opened above you, heralding a new chapter in your life, one of peace, heartfelt simplicity, abundance, and thriving prosperity. Today, I dispel your sadness, mend your spirit, and grant the blessings you rightly deserve. Tell me now, do you believe in my promises? before you resume your daily tasks. Listen to me for just a moment longer. My love for you deepens when I see your good deeds, your dedication to your family, and your commitment to our relationship. I trust in your ability to wisely use the blessings I provide. You are not one to turn away or disobey when I guide your path straight. Many in this world believe they can find fulfillment without me oblivious to the urgency with which their families and their young ones need to know and follow me. But you are different. My words resonate within your home. You have honored me with the place I deserve. Be assured that your home is watched over by angels and maintain your focus on what truly matters, your family, the harmony among you, 
and the never-ending love you share. In all your endeavors, at work and beyond, act with diligence and integrity. Let no harsh words escape your lips that might wound a soul or strike with cruelty. You are a vessel of forgiveness, and my presence will stir you daily, aligning your emotions just as the sun faithfully rises each morning. Your days shall be infused with motivation, serenity, vigor, joy, and peace. This isn't merely a miracle. It's a testament to my divine favor, a blessing from my throne to those who earnestly seek me. I am not elusive, and I am always near. Some claim to search for me and see nothing, their vision obscured. Yet when the scales fall from their eyes, they realize I have always been present. Here I am, smiling upon you. Your life delights me. Do not dwell on your faults or the days when your detractors might return, driven by their envy. Stand strong and resilient. A multitude of blessings and responsibilities will come your way. Opportunities to serve and to give. You and your family will become a source of joy and a beacon of grace to many. Maintain your trust in me. Proclaim it now. I embrace my blessings. I am lifting worries from your heart and infusing your life with peace and joy. I'm attentive to your prayers and will provide the good things you ask for in my perfect timing. Be patient, for I am still at work, moving obstacles, distancing harmful influences, and drawing kind souls to enrich your life. I'm about to transform everything around you. Trust that I will do this. Be prepared to receive the miracles I have planned for you and your loved ones. Your dedication to my word is pleasing to me. Continue to pray, not only for your loved ones, but also for those distant from you. Your prayers ascend to my throne, prompting me to act on your behalf. You will notice profound changes in your character and an intensified eagerness to pursue your dreams. I am lavishing my love upon you and your family. Approach today with calm and listen only to my voice. Many will try to sway you from your path, seeking to bind your commitments, diminish your joy, or lead you astray. Hence, I urge you to proceed with wisdom and vigilance. Be wary of those with ill intentions, as they pose a risk to your well-being. While I am your protector, I respect your choices. If you do not involve me in your decisions or prioritize me, the enemy could divert your focus and seize the blessings already within your grasp. Every day, seek me. Open my word. Listen. And embrace it with gladness. My words of wisdom are spoken with profound love to show you how much I cherish you and to assure you of my continual care. Give me your whole life and heart without reserve. Remain serene for everything is within my grasp. Fill your heart with peace and your spirit with hope. Always hold on to the knowledge of my deep love for you. I know how dearly you love your children. They are precious to me as well. I have inscribed their names in my book, capturing not just their identities, but their hearts, thoughts, desires, challenges, and dreams. I am mindful of their significance to you. I urge you to find peace and release the anxieties born from the choices they make. It may seem they stray from the path, but I encourage you not to dwell on what is beyond your control. Entrust to me all your concerns. Focus instead on your own journey. Excessive worry will only deplete you and steal your peace. Preserve your energy and faith, for I desire your prayers for them. Now is the time to release what must be let go. Your children, like doves, have matured and now must take flight. Release them with confidence, allowing them to spread their wings in freedom, because as long as you pray for them, my protective mantle will always envelop them. Embrace my guidance and trust in my divine will. Your mind needn't be burdened with the weight of controlling outcomes or making decisions for your children, nor with the responsibility of directing their paths. Leave these matters to me. There are boundaries they must respect, the dignity of your family and your home. If they err, silence is not an option. I will endow you with the strength, peace, and wisdom necessary for confrontation, but always ensure that your words are not spoken in anger. 
Be mindful of your words and actions, as they can either wound or heal profoundly. I have never been harsh with you. I haven't meted out punishment as your errors might deserve. Instead, I've offered you love and redemption. Now I ask you to extend the same grace to your children, who hold such a special place in your heart. Understand this, mistakes will happen, and tears may fall. But the salvation that has graced your life will, in due time, reach your children too. Precisely when I have decreed, they will come to the brink, to the moment of genuine repentance, and they will return to you bearing blessings that will enrich your home and extend your joy. Welcome them with forgiveness and a spirit of grace. Open your doors to them once more. Continue to lift them up in prayer. And now embrace the peace I provide. Rest assured, your children are in my care. Don't fret any longer. Even if their actions sometimes startle you or cause pain, remember, they are your children because I entrusted them to your care. You must continue to love them, and I will continue my work in their hearts and lives. Safeguarding and guiding them, your entire family is under my watch. I have heard every prayer and petition. I have taken them to heart, and none has been overlooked. Yet I ask for your patience and for you to accept the peace I offer, for I will answer your prayers in my perfect timing. I know the distress you feel, fearing for your children's safety. Keep praying for them, treating them with kindness and love. My hand is upon them, and you will soon see transformation, initially small changes, but gradually they will begin to walk the path I have laid out for them. Forgive them as I have forgiven you. Continue to communicate with them as I do with you, and as I have never withheld my love or attention, do the same for your children, for they are an extension of your heart. I will grant you the strength and wisdom needed to endure the decisions your children are making. It's challenging. I know, but remember, I am actively working in their lives. For you and your children, I envision a future filled with goodness, peace, prosperity, spiritual growth, family harmony, unity, and understanding. If your home has been a place of tension, arguments, and discord, know that in the days ahead, thanks to your faithful prayers, I will bestow a wonderful tranquility and peace upon it. Your lives will be transformed. Your entire family will change. You will be relieved from worry and your children will start to make wise and responsible choices. My presence and blessings will permeate your home. All this will happen because of my deep love for you and your persistent prayers. Walk by faith and do not harbor doubts. Seek me in the early morning, and as the sun rises and bathes you in its light, so too will my glory shine upon you and illuminate your life. Darkness will recede. Your heart will be filled with my truth your spirit strengthened, and sorrow will vanish from your mind. I urge you to commit anew to prayer, to seeking me, to dedicating time to me, to setting aside distractions, and to surrendering your thoughts and decisions to me. You face formidable challenges and complex situations. There are times when you're unsure of what to do. That's why I urge you, I affirm, I command our, I ask, walk by faith, Everything is possible for those who believe in me, for those who acknowledge my reality, for those who have chosen to trust me fully despite the hurdles they face, those who know of my love and hold fast to me, even when the enemy claims that I have forsaken them to watch them suffer. Understand that my love is eternal and steadfast. I've always protected them, always watched over them. Walk in faith, my child. I long to guide your steps, to ensure your path is smooth. But you must truly believe in me. I am your life, your future, your fortitude, your protector. Trust in me. Believe that the miracles you cannot yet see will indeed come to pass. Have patience for those blessings that remain unseen to your eyes. You may feel your faith is small, but it is precisely what I seek from you. It is enough to sustain you and bring forth numerous blessings into your life. 
Continue to walk in faith. Recall my promises daily. Engage with my words. Let them transform you. Leave your past errors behind. Dedicate your life to me. I see your belief. And I know you will persist in this faith-filled journey. Your dreams are splendid. Your plans ambitious. But the blessings I have in store are even grander. The words I speak to you today are infused with divine encouragement and are steadfast for all who cherish me, who diligently seek my presence, who earnestly follow my commands, who are eager to hear my voice, and who consistently aim to act kindly towards others without prejudice. My promises manifest in the lives and families of those who admit their shortcomings, who are weary of bearing the consequences of their missteps, who acknowledge their failings but yearn for change, for a straightened path, and are ready to let me transform their hearts and steer their destinies. My word is living. When I send it into your home, it will accomplish what I intend and will not return void. It will gather your tears, your anguished cries, your sins, all sealed in a vessel beyond reach. I have cleansed you with my sacrifice. Your faults and transgressions sunk to the sea's depth. I will turn your pain into anthems of praise. Your tears will mingle with the river of life and return to you as vigor and delight. Walk in faith, my child, and trust in the words I speak to you. Approach life with simplicity and humility, for this attitude will ensure that all your endeavors are blessed and, and you are continually safeguarded by my warrior angels. Even when outcomes aren't as you wish, do not be disheartened. Remember, my angels are engaged in a fierce battle on your behalf for the desires of your heart. You must stand firm and persist. Merely sitting in sorrow won't suffice. I am here to heal your wounds, to offer solace, to revitalize your spirits, and to inspire new dreams within you. Behold, the gates of heaven are poised to unleash profound blessings that have been destined for you since creation. I know the journey is challenging. Truly worthwhile things often are. I seek your complete surrender and a heart filled with gratitude. Like a potter shapes clay, I am shaping you, removing the flawed and enhancing the good within you. Above all, remember my love for you is steadfast, a treasure that cannot be stolen or diminished. Now respond to me, affirm your belief in my promises, and let these words I have bestowed upon you invigorate your spirit to continue the battle with renewed faith. Today marks the beginning of a profound transformation within your family. As you hear these words, my power and love envelop you, initiating the change. I have chosen you to be the cornerstone of this miracle. Through your words, your touch, your gaze, and your actions, you will embody the divine catalyst for this transformation. You hold a special place in my heart, and I have always assured you of my love. Now it's your turn to extend this love to those in your care. Today, express your love to them openly. Show them you understand their struggles and their needs. Lay your hands upon them in a gesture of blessing. Pray for them with all the earnestness of your heart. Dedicate your resources, your time, and your entire being first and foremost to those closest to you, your family at home, your distant relatives, and even those estranged by old grievances. Forgive and embrace them with kindness. Your family will flourish under the nourishment of your care and the power of your prayers. They will find harmony and reap the blessings of your faithful efforts. Be patient with them and let them know that home is a sanctuary of genuine love where they can always find solace after the trials of the day. There will be times when you need to guide them to gently correct their course. If they value your love, they will heed your counsel. Should they resist, entrust them to my care through your prayers. I am already at work in their hearts, softening and molding them. In time, they will see their errors. Return to the right path and acknowledge the changes they need to make. In moments of family strife, come to me in quiet prayer. Setting aside anger and frustration, those visitors who should find no home with those who know my grace, there is always a path forward from your troubles. 
always an answer to your deepest questions. I hold solutions to your worries. When irritation tempts you to raise your voice, ask quickly for my strength to maintain calm, preserving the peace of my spirit within you. Take shelter in my presence. When burdens grow too heavy, call out to me. I will surely answer. When you need support, rest assured I will be there, guiding and uplifting you with my love. Your home will be a sanctuary of profound peace, complete joy, and bountiful provision. For in my realm all things are possible. Confide in me. Open your eyes to my peace enveloping you. Feel the serenity of my presence encircling you, comforting your spirit, affirming your right to experience life fully. The world outside may press upon you with its chaos and consequences, yet you must not let others' turmoil disturb your peace. In this sacred moment with me, disconnect from the world's clamor and savor the tranquility we share. This time is precious to me, and I hope it brings you profound joy. Let us meet like this daily, whether at dawn or the day's beginning, ready for a moment of communion, a precious exchange between us. In this sacred moment, as you grasp my hand, kneeling before my throne, understand the profound reach of your faith. Today marks a pivotal chapter in your life, a day you will cherish always. I am sealing your heart with my promise, declaring before all creation that you are irrevocably mine. This revelation will transform your understanding and awaken you to the depths of my love. You are immensely blessed, more than you ever realized, and with this knowledge, you will see that all things are within your reach. Who can stand against you? You are my beloved child, invincible under my watch. My love is the greatest force, surpassing any earthly bond you've known. If earthly figures have failed you, remember, I am not like them. Today, you see the truth of my unfailing presence. Rest here a while longer in the serenity of my presence. Speak not, simply bask in the peace of our communion. Let the weight of your burdens dissolve in my embrace. As you step out today, your countenance will radiate the peace you've received here. You will carry this calm into the world, untouchable by turmoil. Every sunrise is a testament to my love for you. I eagerly anticipate our daily meetings, where I can envelop you in my care. Consider my position. How could I not lavish love and blessings upon you? My ultimate gift is your eternal salvation, ensuring you never have to fear, always feel cherished and protected, and navigate life with dignity. Wrapped in my embrace, I sacrifice myself on the cross so that you might move from victory to victory, transcending the sorrows of defeat. My resurrection on the third day was to affirm your right to a life filled with more than just the material, to live fully in the supernatural assurance of my love, Unlike others who endure isolation and despair, you stand apart, enveloped in my eternal grace. If ever you find yourself weary, if the weight of the world bends your shoulders, rise up. Lift your arms high as a signal of triumph. Proclaim to the heavens and the earth, I am the cherished child of my heavenly Father, mighty, courageous, a vanquisher of countless challenges, a titan among titans. Nothing can subdue you. No force can prevail against you. You are never isolated, never merely drifting through shadows and despair. Summon your strength, for I'm calling you home to me. In my embrace, you find your fortress. As you kneel, the legions of heaven rally to your side with gleaming swords that cut through the tumult, banishing the darkness. Your adversaries, the whisperers of fear and doubt, cower and flee from the radiant shield that surrounds you. They may roar their threats from a distance, but they cannot touch you. Their words dissolve into the void, powerless against the armor I have given you. Who among you will grasp this truth? I speak directly to your heart. This message is a bastion for your spirit, a song to carry within, a chant of empowerment. Lift your arms once more and declare with all your might, I am endlessly loved by my magnificent Heavenly Father, my Lord, our, my protector. 
I am restored, liberated, sagacious, and insightful. I possess the prowess and fidelity of a true champion. Let this be your morning anthem. Let this faith root deeply within you, anchored firmly in my everlasting word. My precious child, you are never alone. You need not seek validation from the world, for you are forever cherished by me. My love for you is woven into the fabric of every moment, subtle, yet overwhelmingly present. Acknowledge this love. Let me hear your voice declare your affection for me. For every prayer you whisper, from the grand to the most humble, is heard. I promise to respond, to gift you with the finest and most splendid blessings. We are ascending together here in this earthly realm. Your journey is a faith-filled march through lands of promise. Never be swayed merely by what your eyes can perceive. Challenges may arise, losses may occur, but do not be seized by fear. My presence envelops you with divine might. I am your protector, your tender and loving father. Your greatest strength lies in the trust you place in my words, the confidence that I, your heavenly father, cherish you deeply, offering a love that is beautiful, sweet, majestic, and beyond earthly comparison, divine and eternal. Even in the fiercest battles, when adversity seeks to claim your spirit and you find yourself marred by life's trials, remember, you are held aloft by my spirit. Rise up. Tears may streak your face, but your heart is fortified by my grace. Continue on this path of faith, love, loyalty, hope, and sincerity. Know that beyond every hurdle lies a life abundantly blessed, cradled in my grace and goodness. I rejoice each day as you awaken with joy and resolve, unshackled from the shadows of your past, no longer entertaining thoughts of loneliness and despair. Each day, you affirm the reality of my power, showing how much can be accomplished when you persist in the beautiful faith you offer me. Your faith is the most precious gift you could give, your heart, your surrender, your unwavering belief that my promises are true, even when your eyes cannot yet see the outcomes. Believe in this truth. The season of drought has ended, and the time of harvest begins. The challenges you faced were preparations for the immense blessings that are nearing. I hear your urgent prayers and your queries about their arrival. Once again, I assure you, the fulfillment of my promises is just beyond your doorstep. Engage your faith, rise, and open the door. Approach this moment with a spirit of victory. Do not seek out obstacles or excuses to remain idle. Cast aside the doubts that stifle your faith. Your talents and gifts are ready to flourish. Here on earth, a splendid garden awaits. And you are needed not merely as a flower, but as a robust tree, providing shelter and shade to those who seek refuge in my presence. Tell me now that you believe, for your belief shapes the reality of your blessings. I have chosen you as a vessel to bring blessings, to speak of love to your family, and to extend your hand to those in need, as you give and share. Expect a downpour of prosperity over your home. Dear one, ready your tools. The time for harvest approaches. Venture out and breathe in the scent of the fields, ripe and awaiting your victory. You are one of my anointed, strengthened, and upheld by my hand. I will eliminate any lack or deficiency from your life. Yet heed this counsel. Do not follow the path of those who neglect my words who squander their days in trivial pursuits and then blame me when misfortune strikes. They grumble in envy, desiring to claim the blessings I have reserved for you. The fruits of the forthcoming harvest are yours to claim. Do not rely on others to gather them. Those who do not value my grace may discard what I have provided. Guard the gifts I bestow upon you closely. Do not entrust your precious charges to those who might harm them. Keep your home safe from those who would seek to destroy. Come to me each morning for guidance. I will impart the wisdom you need to prosper and succeed, ensuring your harvest is bountiful and even greater than expected. This phase of your life is a preparation for something extraordinary that awaits. 
Look forward to it and expect much from your Heavenly Father. I do not give sparingly but shower you with abundant blessings. Believe this, embrace it, and consistently express your love for me. I will lead you from barrenness to a place of victory and profound joy, for I cherish you immensely and have a grand purpose for your life. Pay attention to these words, for they are filled with truth and life. I see the hardship you face and the sadness that dims your joy. This difficult season is nearing its end, and a miraculous transformation awaits you. The days of grief and misapprehension are fading away, and now, as you step out of this desert, a new chapter begins. The world has tried to obscure your vision and shake your faith, but you, my beloved child, have remained steadfast. You have endured this strenuous trial, and your perseverance has brought you to the threshold of renewal. From this moment, I promise brighter days and reasons for laughter. All who surround you will witness the strength and power with which I rejuvenate your spirit in astonishing ways. My wisdom will guide you through the complexities you've encountered. You've walked a parched path, felt exhaustion, and experienced weakness. Yet it was your faith and love for me, for your family, that fueled your resolve to press onward. Today, I am sending clouds heavy with rain, not just any rain, but a deluge of blessings, a healing balm for your spirit. I am pouring out my spirit of love into your soul, reaffirming the covenant I have made with you. I have always listened. My ears are attuned to your voice whenever you call upon me in prayer. You stand on the brink of a period filled with miracles and wonders, a time of divine fulfillment for you and your loved ones. This is your reward for your unwavering loyalty for your relentless faith, for not yielding under the weight of trials, and for trusting your destiny to my hands. My beloved child, hear my promise. I will never fail you, for my love for you is boundless. I know the plans I have for you, plans for good, not for harm. Whatever you ask in faith, express it once more, and I will listen from the heavens and grant the deepest desires of your heart. Rejoice for your days of hardship are concluding. Your moment of triumph approaches swiftly. Proclaim your belief in me, for I cherish you deeply. You may feel as though I am distant or that I have left you to face your struggles alone. Yet I assure you today, I have always been near, attentive to each prayer and aware of every tear you've shed before me. Today, I affirm my love for you and remind you of your special place in my heart. There is no joy greater for me than to know you are my child and I am your protector, your father, your mother, your brother, your God. Approach me freely, without fear of judgment. Understand that I am a constant God. I am the same now as I was before and will be forever. My love for you is eternal. Do not hesitate to bring your desires before me. If I spared not my own son but gave him up for you, how will I not also? along with him, graciously give you all things. Today marks the day of your miracle, the day of your victory. Claim each of my promises as your own. Sickness will flee at my presence. Tormenting spirits will bow at my name, the name above all names. Your familial and financial woes meet their resolution now. Simply believe, I am your support, your upholder, providing renewed vigor for the journey ahead. Even if others doubt you, know that I have always seen the immense potential I placed within you. Now is the time to rise, to shine brilliantly. I am your God who empowers you. I will never abandon you or leave your side. Take my hand. Let us journey forward together. Come closer in our relationship. Talk to me, and I will respond. My love for you is everlasting. If only you knew the joy I feel when we talk each day. It benefits you immensely as well. You long to hear from me, to spend time in my presence. Yet often you forget life's demands, the weariness of your days, and the clutter in your mind pull you away. You run on empty, not realizing your need to be filled by me. Come, bring me your worries. Immerse yourself in my living waters and witness the transformation. 
you will notice a change. Your spirit and body will strengthen. Your disposition will brighten. All I ask is for a little of your time. Despite your busy life, a few moments with me is all I require. Bring your faith, that's all I need. Try it. Morning. Night. It doesn't matter when. I am always ready to nourish you with the honey of the rock and the finest wheat. In my presence, time stands still. The minutes you spend with me become strength, encouragement, divine joy, sublime peace, and supernatural enthusiasm. They turn into holy wisdom and showers of blessings that cascade over you like rivers from heaven, clear, eternal, and deep. When you approach me with all your faith, you ascend to a higher realm. You find rest for your soul in this beautiful expanse. Your mind settles, your thoughts clear. Here, in this serene place, there are no storms or chaos, only peace. Stay here a bit longer. Open your hands wide to receive all that I have for you. Let your heart be filled with these blessings. Gather gifts in abundance. Clothe your spirit with my mantle of strength and take this tranquility back into the world. How splendid and magnificent it is to feel the touch of my hand upon your head. The fiery presence of my Holy Spirit purifying all that is unclean within you. The precious moments you dedicate to me each day are reshaping your life gently and gradually. This is the right pace. There is no need to hurry, no need to run. Embrace this process and understand its worth. You will come to know me so deeply that doubts will no longer cloud your thoughts. Even in your greatest trials, when I seem silent, know that my love for you is unwavering. And in time, uh, my hand will reach out to aid you. You stand on the brink of new and grander opportunities than those you've seen closed before you. You've kept faith, trusting in my might. I will restore what was lost to you. Soon you will witness an abundance of profound blessings accumulating in your life. Turn away from dwelling on past losses, broken relationships, or failures. Whether they stemmed from your own errors, for which you've repented, or from the actions of others, release any bitterness. Banish thoughts of hatred and revenge from your heart. If deception has marred your past, you've moved beyond the grief and learned whom to trust. Do not linger on what lies behind. Instead, set your sights on the multitude of blessings I am eager to bestow upon you. We are stepping forward into victory on a fresh path. Look towards the horizon, where a mountain stands majestic. As you crest its peak, you will proceed with renewed vigor and strength. On the far side, fertile fields await your harvest. Dear child, know deeply that you are vitally important to me and cherish yourself as well. Show your reverence by living according to my teachings, nurturing not only your body but also your soul and spirit. Each morning, awake with the divine certainty that your life is purposeful and filled with potential blessings I have set before you. The future holds the success of your family, your own achievements, and the flourishing of all you touch. You possess ample wisdom to spread joy among those who suffer in this world. As my words reach you, they infuse your mind, soul, and spirit with extraordinary joy, dispelling any shadows of depression or doubt. This profound sense of well-being is a sign of my grace, mercy, and love unfolding in your life. Expect miracles to manifest. The world around you will witness these wonders and recognize the divine light that radiates from you. However, Remain humble and guard your heart against pride. I will demonstrate to the world that I uplift the downtrodden, the neglected, those scorned, and wrongly judged. All forthcoming triumphs are manifestations of my might. I, the King of Glory, hold your life and your family's welfare in my hands, and I extend mercy to you. Embrace this love openly and simply. Let me bless you abundantly, as it pleases me. Heed these words attentively. Stay with me. Listen until the end. Avoid distractions and resist sinking into complaints or frustrations. This moment tests your patience. I'm observing whether you can faithfully listen, 
accept, value, and adhere to these sacred words I am placing within your soul today. Every morning as you awaken, come and hear my voice. I am fully aware of the challenges you face. There are days you may feel too weary even to think, but I urge you to be diligent and courageous. A single word spoken in faith has the power to heal, uplift, and bring prosperity into your life instantly. It is real. It is possible. Decide today to believe wholeheartedly that I can transform you with my love, patience, commandments, and wise counsel. I can turn your trials into a new dawn of joy and blessings. You hold great value to me and to many around you. While some may fail to appreciate your efforts and love, I see all that you do. Your acts of selfless love are recorded in my book. You are never alone. Alongside me, a host of witnesses, both in heaven and on earth, sees you and supports you, including warrior angels prepared to engage in battle, tear down your adversary, and clear your path of obstacles. There are those who love you and intercede for you. Your name is spoken in my presence daily. I sacrifice my life so that you could experience salvation, freedom, and peace amidst your struggles. In the days ahead, I will unveil the transformative power of my sacrifice, which will bring blessings to both you and your family. I am eager to assist you, but I am also moved by your determination to progress and your genuine desire to succeed. Promise me that you will trust in my words. Commit to listening to my voice each morning. Open your eyes wide and pay close attention. Soon you will begin to perceive new and wonderful things around you. Now is the time to truly understand who I am and to seek me with all your heart. I love you dearly. I am extending my hand to you. Believe in me. I will transform your life. Come closer. I am here to reassure you that you're never alone. Yesterday, you shed tears over the unexpected hardships that befell you. Things went awry, and those you believed cared for you turned away just when you needed them most. It's understandable that you feel overwhelmed by sadness. But take heart, for your cries have ascended to the heavens, reaching my throne. Where futures are shaped, sicknesses are healed, and troubles find resolution. I am here with you in your sorrow, never having forsaken you. Though those you trusted may have departed, my love for you only grows stronger each day, and it shall remain forever. Live with the assurance that I am ever ready to hear your voice. And through the power of my sacrifice, you have direct access to my presence. You are welcome to pour out your heart to me. And I will listen with infinite patience and love, as a true friend would. I encourage you to release your pain, to cry if you must, letting go of the burdens that weigh on your soul so I can restore your peace. However, I also want to prepare you for what follows your sorrow, immense joy. Your happiness will soon know no bounds, for now is the time I have chosen to bless you abundantly. You're ready to appreciate the gifts I have in store. All your trials were but preparations for this moment, the time when the heavens will open wide to shower you with blessings unimaginable. This is your time, a moment long awaited, now unfolding before you, my beloved child. Today marks a new beginning for you, a moment where every chain of negativity that has held you back is broken. Today, I declare an end to every lack, every illness, and every ounce of sadness that has weighed you down. Let go of those defeating thoughts and frustrations that have clouded your spirit. Hold tightly to your faith, knowing deeply in your heart that my love for you is boundless, and I am ever present to uplift you. I will transform your sorrow into joy and fortify you with the strength to surmount the challenges that life presents. I am fully aware of the daily struggles you endure. Sometimes it might seem like you are caught in a relentless cycle of difficulties, but I assure you, each trial is sculpting your strength and drawing you closer to me. Remember, I have bestowed upon you not a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and self-discipline. With my guidance, 
You are more than capable of overcoming any obstacle and weathering any storm. Do not listen to the whispers of defeat from the enemy who wants you to feel beaten and trapped. Those are lies, for I have grand plans for you, plans filled with hope and aimed at your success, not disaster. My deepest desire is to see you thrive and to remind you that your fate is not shaped by worldly fluctuations but by my eternal love and unshakable promises. Know this, whenever you stumble, I am there to lift you. Whenever you feel weak, my strength will manifest perfectly within you. My grace is always sufficient for you, for in your weakness, my power reaches its fullest expression. So when your heart is heavy and your spirit falters, seek my presence. I promise to renew your strength and rejuvenate your faith. Trust in me, for I am with you always. My dear child, often, the obstacles you encounter are veiled opportunities for growth, learning, and maturation. Embrace these moments with joy, for each challenge is a stepping stone, refining your faith and fostering endurance within you. Through these times of trial, you're being fortified and purified, making you ready to embrace the myriad blessings I have in store for you. Protect your heart diligently. It is the source of life itself. Do not allow the voices and opinions of others to cloud your judgment or sway you from the path I have laid out for you. Always remember your identity. You are a beloved child of the Almighty. As you journey through life, know with certainty that you are never alone. I've dispatched angels to safeguard and direct you. Even as you traverse daunting valleys, fear no darkness, for I am right beside you. Now is the moment to arise, to claim the heritage I have promised, and to march confidently toward the destiny that awaits you. Trust in me wholeheartedly and lean not on your own understanding. In all your endeavors, acknowledge me, and I will direct your path. Let me be your sanctuary, your strength, and your guide. Together, we will journey toward a life filled with blessings, purpose, and triumph. Those who seek shelter in the Most High will find rest in my protective shadow. In me, you will discover a refuge and strength, a God in whom you can place your complete trust. When life's storms seem overwhelming, remember that I am your shield and your fortress. Taking refuge in me means that the dangers that lurk by day and the threats that prowl by night will not touch you. Even if calamities strike close to you, no harm will come your way, no disaster will near your home. For I have commanded my angels to watch over you in all your ways, they will carry you in their hands, ensuring that not even your foot will brush against a stone. You shall not fear the night's terror or the day's adversity, for you belong to me forever, sheltered by my love. You know me and place your trust in me. I will deliver you and bring honor to your name. When you cry out to me, I will answer. I'm with you in times of trouble. I will rescue you and lift you up in glory. My promises, coupled with your faith, unleash supernatural and transformative power. But I require your trust and steadfastness. Your future rests securely in my hands, and I pledge to grant you a long life and reveal my salvation to you. No matter the dangers that surround you, you will always find safety in my presence. I am your refuge in times of distress. When the world seems to crumble around you, I am the unshakable rock to which you can cling, free from fear. Do not allow fear to paralyze you or derail your dreams and purposes. I am your protector and guide, and with me, you will confront and conquer every adversity. Remember, my love for you is eternal. I am always here to protect, nurture, heal, and comfort you. Believe, and you will witness powerful miracles unfolding in your life today. Hold on a little longer, you can do it. Reflect on the paths you have trodden and the achievements you have made, even in moments of weakness when reaching this point seemed impossible. I urge you to resist, persevere, and persist. I am by your side. You can overcome. When this challenging season passes, your relationship with me will be deeper and stronger. 
When this storm subsides, you will emerge more steadfast than ever, unbreakable and unshakable. At times, you have questioned why I allowed you to endure such hardships. There were moments you felt abandoned or punished, but that is not the truth. I have a profound purpose for your life, one that surpasses your understanding. I desire to shower you with abundant blessings. The trials and struggles you have faced are preparing you for greater things, for unexpected blessings. Dwell in my word and treasure its wisdom. Hold fast to my counsel. Refrain from dwelling on baseless fears. Release yourself from judgment and resentment. Surrender your days, your hours, and your minutes to me. Focus on my sacred word, which brings peace and strength to your soul. Leave behind the burdens that weigh you down and forget everything that hinders your trust and understanding of me. I am renewing your heart. The past is behind you. Embrace the freedom I offer and let go of all that hinders your faith. My beloved child, receive this wonderful blessing. Liberate your spirit from the shadows of past hurts and discard the bitter memories that linger in your thoughts. If you find yourself speechless or reluctant to speak, come to me nonetheless. Sit in silence before me. I am here to be with you in your moments of solitude, to wrap you in my love and to remind you of how deeply I cherish you. Even without words, I understand the whispers of your heart. I am intimately acquainted with your emotions. Trust in me, for I am crafting a bright new future for you, a future filled with blessings that are just around the corner. I love you immensely. At this very moment, I am touching your heart soothing your thoughts, and infusing your soul, spirit, mind, and body with life and vitality. Draw in the strength bestowed upon you today by my Holy Spirit. Ignore the harsh criticisms that come your way. Those voices that label you as sorrowful, faded, bitter, or spent are spreading falsehoods. Know this, I do not see the years that mark your life. Your celebrations are joyous to me but I do not tally your birthdays. My love looks beyond the grays in your hair or any imperfections on your skin. In my eyes, uh, you are perfectly beautiful, lacking nothing. The faith, purity, and grace that adorn your soul are the true gifts that delight me. My presence envelops you mightily this day. I wish for you to embrace a divine spirit, to feel the warm embrace of my Holy Spirit. Turn away from the frustrations and challenges of yesterday and set your gaze firmly on me. I am your healer, your protector, and your sustainer. The words I speak to you today are to fortify you. They will embed themselves in your mind, shining as a beacon to guide your path. They reveal potential hurdles in your life and endow you with the wisdom to navigate them correctly. Anticipate new blessings with each new day. Delight in their discovery. Welcome them with joy each time you kneel in gratitude before me. A sacred anointing flows over you, mending your emotions and soothing your feelings. You are shielded from head to toe. Fear nothing, for I am with you. You will not forfeit a single blessing. I am positioning you in a lush and verdant place where you will flourish abundantly. What has been taken from you by the enemy will be restored manifold and blessed. You are truly mine. You belong to me. Let your heart overflow with joy and delight. The sweetness of your spirit radiates to those around you, and your vibrant, youthful spirit is a marvel. You have a beautiful heart, my child. When you speak to me and express your love, my eyes fill with tears, and my heart swells with tender affection. I saw your fear. I heard the anxious cries of your heart desiring to flee from your troubles. You called out for my help, pleading urgently for my mighty hand to intervene. I understand your distress. This issue is significant to you, and much depends on its resolution. Left to your own strength, you felt powerless and feared that I was displeased with you, that perhaps I was unwilling to assist. Know this, you will always need me in times of both trouble and prosperity. Do not let down your guard, for the enemy seeks any opportunity to shake your faith, disrupt your plans, 
and wound your spirit. Be assured I am moving to aid you in your current struggle. It pains me to see you so sorrowful and troubled. It is not my desire for you to live in torment. I do not wish for you to continue feeling this way. Rather than fixating on the same worrisome thoughts, let them go and entrust them to me. If thoughts of defeat creep into your mind, reject them as the falsehoods they are. Defeat is not your destiny, for you have placed your faith in the Almighty God. If discouragement tugs at your heart, do not entertain it, for that would be a grave error. Those who trust in my power and anticipate my blessings cannot be disheartened. If the zest for life begins to slip through your fingers, clutch tighter to your faith. You serve a mighty and sovereign God who will rekindle the flames of divine love in your heart and fill you with a renewed desire to persevere. Hold tightly to the promises I'm speaking over you now. Your adversaries may belittle you, claiming you are unworthy of life, but you must no longer heed their lies. I have decreed that you shall live, and very soon you will experience, feel our, and receive my blessings. The trials you face will fade, your life will brighten, and the concerns that weigh heavily on you will soon be resolved. My child, if you're hearing this message, it's no coincidence. Tell me you believe that you will continue to fight despite all obstacles, and that your love for me will endure forever. Today and every day, I want you to dwell in a profound sense of security, knowing that your joy and your future are anchored in me, not reliant on anyone or anything else in this world. I'm the one who gave my life for you, who, uh, with my own blood, cleared the debt of your sins. Through my resurrection, I have bestowed upon you the gift of life, filled with power and glory. You are familiar with loneliness, have encountered pain, stared down death, and at times nearly succumbed to despair. Yet, you remembered my deep love for you. In your darkest hours, you cried out to me, and even in your dreams, you reached for me. I heard you, healed your wounds, and not only forgave but forgot your missteps. I instilled in you a vibrant and renewed faith, and through it, you emerged triumphant. Having learned and grown stronger, now ready to chase your dreams with a courage founded on my promises, knowing just how deeply you are loved by your Heavenly Father, I present you now with an opportunity of immense importance. It was bought at the price of my sacrifice and it cannot be overlooked. For the sake of your family, you must engage fully, harnessing all your strength. You must move beyond your current circumstances. Today, I'm equipping you with essential resources, your time, your energy. Do not be led astray again by companions who chase mere illusions. Place not your hopes in people or things destined to falter. I have blessed you with a heart capable of true love, passionate struggle, and steadfast progression. Let go of the past. Embrace the new and wonderful things I'm doing in your life. I chose to bless you because you're precious in my sight. However, cherish these gifts wisely. Do not entangle yourself in unwise debts or ventures without seeking my guidance and affirming my will. Avoid making commitments you cannot fulfill and carrying burdens that are not yours to bear. Exercise wisdom, caution, and patience. I will restore and elevate your life, positioning you as a leader in your family and community respected by all. Witness what I can achieve through someone who loves, serves, obeys, and truly believes in me. Share this message with those dear to you and ready yourself for the fulfillment of my promise in your life. I have reserved the finest for you. My blessings will reach you, and whatever you feel you've lost will pale in comparison to what lies ahead. You may not grasp it now, but everything I do is purposeful. I provide precisely what you need. For every sorrow, I will bring a thousand joys. For every financial hardship, a future of divine prosperity. For every illness, Leo healing. For every conflict, a resolution. For every danger, my safeguarding presence. 
I will lay my hands upon your life. You will forever be secure in my loving care and affection. Let not your heart be weighed down by discouragement. Trust in me, and remember that my vision extends far beyond what your eyes can see. I know precisely what is best for you. I hear every prayer. I know your dreams. And what I have in store for you surpasses anything you could possibly imagine. So do not be saddened or feel that I am taking away from your life. Rather, understand that I am clearing away the unnecessary, making room for you to grasp the magnificent blessings that are on their way. Believe in this. Expect it with confidence and never doubt. My promise to you will soon be fulfilled. The gifts I am preparing to place in your hands are designed for your good, meant to enrich not just your life, but also the lives of your family. Promise me your trust. Tell me you believe. Commit yourself to seek me daily, to come before me so I may enrich your life. Meet with me each morning. I long to see you and to keep your faith vibrant and strong. You are on the brink of a marvelous transformation. To fully embrace this new chapter, you must stand firm, full of faith and trust. Do not fear to tread this fresh path. I will fortify you and supply all your needs. I see beyond your current circumstances and have prepared the very best for you. Have faith in this truth. Come, let us converse. Pour out all that burdens your heart. Speak to me openly and honestly. I have reassured you time and again that your mistakes do not cause me to turn away from you. I know you intimately, and though it might be difficult for you to accept, I love you exactly as you are. I am eager to reveal to you the vastness of my love. When you feel it, embrace it wholeheartedly. This pure love, unlike any other you will find, is yours to hold. Remember this profound affection. It is more real and true than any earthly experience. Sometimes, you may feel that I set conditions for my blessings, but understand that my desire to bless you abundantly is unconditional and rooted in my infinite love for you. Give me your heart, that is all I ask, and you have lovingly complied. Your heart belongs to me. Though there are moments you may forget this as distractions pull you away, do not equate me with those who judge harshly, who impose their will, trying to manipulate and deceive. They claim to speak for me, fabricating sins and punishments to crush your spirit. They have misled you into believing that it is I who judge you harshly, that my wrath has been your punishment. Yet, understand this, my sacrifice on the cross was not in vain. I shed my blood for all your transgressions, the ones made in ignorance before you knew me, those committed during times of rebellion when you rejected my plan for you, and those born from moments of weakness and distraction. But it was with love that I approached you offering forgiveness time and again. You embraced it with joy, and this revived faith is why we are conversing today. I am revealing something profound to you. This is not your imagination. You will come to understand and trust in my love more deeply, feeling it with you at every moment from now on. This understanding will empower you each day to rise with thankfulness, breaking free from past constraints, eager to live fully, to do good, to serve, and to assist your family and others. Banish all fear from your heart and make ample room for my blessings. You will experience my presence in your life in a deeply meaningful and special way starting today, and this you will not forget. I love you dearly. Remember, people do not determine your destiny. Doors open at my command. I will lavish my love and care upon you and your family. Nothing can sever our bond. My love for you is eternal and unwavering. Even if you falter a thousand times, my grace and forgiveness remain ever accessible to you. I am always with you. That is my everlasting promise. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not fear, for I am by your side. Do not be dismayed or disheartened. Do not let the negativity you witness steal your faith. I am your God your father, your king, your friend. I will fortify and support you in all things. I'm arriving at the perfect moment to reveal my power in your life, 
to show you that I have a distinct plan just for you. Remember, despite all challenges, my love for you is unwavering. I sought you out at your lowest point when your heart was heaviest with sorrow to demonstrate how precious you are to me. I will never grow weary of affirming this truth, and you will never tire of hearing it. No weapon formed against you shall prosper, and you will refute every accusation spoken against you. Those who spread falsehoods and slander against you and your loved ones are also rising against me. Stand firm in your faith and do not be swayed from this truth you must embrace. Nourish yourself with the life-giving words of my promise, not with the harmful slanders of the world. Hear my voice daily as I speak of my eternal love so that all doubt, sadness, and despair may flee from your heart. You are my child, and my covenant with you is secured by my own blood. Fear not, for I am with you always. I grant you strength, peace, and power. Here is your assurance, starting today. You will rise victorious, and your circumstances will transform. Believe in the promises I have made. Be strong and courageous. Place your trust in me and watch as everything changes for the better. I'm speaking directly to your soul with words designed to dispel every shadow of doubt and confusion from your mind. You are enveloped in my divine protection, surrounded by thousands of angels poised and ready at my command to defend you, to safeguard your family, and to repel the deceitful enemy who schemes to ensnare you. My cherished child, a remarkable era of peace and abundance is on the horizon. I desire for you to soar like an eagle, to rise above and see the profound impact your steadfast faith has on your family, bringing blessings abundant. My love and blessings are forever with you. Never question this. This morning, I want you to understand that I heard the prayer you whispered last night before sleep overtook you. I saw the tears you shed, your thoughts heavy against your pillow, your heart gripped by fear. In your tears, you sought encouragement, strength, peace, and security to confront life's myriad challenges. Now, as you open your eyes to this new day, feel the transformation within you. You are ready and fortified, your spirit rejuvenated. Gone is the weakness and despondence that once burdened you. You possess the courage to confront any giant that dares to challenge you. Fear has been replaced with faith. Doubt has given way to bravery. Yesterday, your legs may have quivered at the prospect of impending troubles. But today, you stand resolute and poised for victory. It is time to rise and press forward. I have ignited a blazing passion within you to succeed. Trust in my power. For if I have guided you to this moment, it is because I am also the source of your strength, empowering you to face and conquer a thousand giants. The challenges before you are significant, but always remember that they pale in comparison to my might. Indeed, it is I who have brought you to this place. I have never left your side. My dear child, know this. I will always stand beside you through every struggle. Battle and war you face in this life. You are more than a conqueror through my strength and love. Each giant that dares rise against you is destined to fall. I infuse you with the resilience and resolve needed to surmount any challenge. Set your sights on overcoming these obstacles and living in a state of abundance and complete peace. In this critical moment, shift your gaze from your worries to focus on me. All that you encounter is designed to nurture your faith. Through my word, saturate your mind with my promises and watch as your fears dissipate. With my presence in your heart, there is no one you cannot face. No battle you cannot win. Be emboldened by my love. And as this day closes, come and speak with me. Let us converse. And I will bestow upon you a special blessing. Rise up and walk forward. Engage in the strength of my Holy Spirit. When the time for battle comes, you will stand undefeated. You are not weak. You are imbued with strength. You possess my love. You carry faith. And remember this truth. All things are possible for those who believe. Invite me into your home today. Open every door. 
every window of your life. Allow my holy blessing to enter, to bring healing to your soul and rest to your heart. Yesterday, I purified your home from all its flaws. I breathed life into every corner, with my voice. I shook the foundations of your thoughts and cleared away the residues of your past pains. You are cleansed and forgiven. Now it's time to embrace this truth. Understand that while you are not without imperfection and may face temptations, you are my beloved child. I love you dearly, and your humanity only deepens my affection for you. Continue on your path, tightly gripping my hand. If you commit daily to seeking me, loving me with all your heart and mind, and surrendering your life to me completely, I promise to always be by your side. I will lift you up and help you to press onward, even if you falter. I know it is not your intention to sin. When your adversaries try to drag you through the mud and revel in your distress, remember to look up to me. I have called you into this battle, and it is by my power that you are cleansed, strengthened, and forgiven time and again. Your adversaries are corrupt and ruthless, devoid of remorse or repentance. Their conscience is dulled, they envy the cloak of victory I have draped over you, and they will employ every tactic to disrupt the peace and security you feel today. But hear my voice. Know that I understand your heart. You love your family deeply and desire their success. This journey will require courage, diligent work, unwavering faith, and trust in my promises. You are destined for great blessings, and your enemies recognize this which fuels their attempts to deter you. They underestimated you, viewing you as weak, never anticipating that you would come to me, acknowledge your vulnerabilities and sins. It is for this reason I have chosen to forgive, uplift, and prosper you. I'm with you every day. No one can stand against you. No one will humiliate, defeat, or conquer you. Should you stumble, I will be there to raise you up. This is my promise to you. Your family and your entire household, even those far away, will come to know me in a profound and supernatural way. My dear child, I cherish hearing your prayers. Your faith brings me immense joy. It delights me to see how you dedicate the first moments of each day to me, offering your sincerity, respect, petitions, praise, and adoration. Such a disposition warms my heart. It is a joy to see you give me your heart so freely. Your faith is genuine and deep, despite the many trials that have marred your self-image. Today, I assure you from my own lips you possess a good heart. Yes, you have stumbled at times, but you always return to me with a repentant heart, seeking another chance. And it is this new opportunity I am eager to grant you each day. When you approach me with faith, believing firmly in the blessings you seek, you have my promise I will answer. Never doubt my response. I will act in my perfect timing, and I know you will wait patiently for that moment to arrive. Do not lose heart. Keep your gaze fixed on the blessings that are approaching. My promises are steadfast and true. My word is everlasting, and my power is actively working in your life. However, it is your faith and dedication that sustain you. I need your faith to work even greater miracles in you. Embrace and accept the blessings I send. Move away from past doubts that hindered your belief in receiving the many wonderful things I long to give you. You once thought yourself undeserving, lacking in faith, but you have learned and grown from these experiences. Now you understand how your faith also aids you in making vital decisions guarding your heart against evil, and implementing my teachings in your life. Your faith has been the key to changing so much around you. You've expressed concerns about the size of your faith, but remember, even if it is as small as a mustard seed, it is magnificent and powerful in my eyes. Look around and see the transformations occurring. I'm responding to your prayers, strengthening your heart, and preparing even greater miracles for the path ahead. Hold my hand tightly. We are almost there. With the faith you hold today, no challenge will overpower you. As you stand firm, 
knowing I hold your future. All your needs will be met through me, for I am the one who blesses your life abundantly. Stay in my presence, I am safely sheltered under my protection. In your moments of worry, draw near to me and embrace the peace I offer. Do not fall prey to the enemy's lies suggesting your challenges are insurmountable. My power far exceeds any obstacle, and your faith in me is mighty. Place your trust in me, not in human endeavors, your employment, or mere fortune. For the health, joy, and peace you seek, you should always turn to me in your needs, and you shall be provided for. Yet, do not merely sit and wait. Rise and walk by faith towards the goals you know you must achieve. Even if the world around you is in turmoil, you are not bound by its rules. Your strength is drawn from me. I am the only one in the universe who can truly sustain you, empower you, broaden your perspectives, and enhance your joy. When you feel a lack in your faith, recall those past moments when you cried out in your pain, feeling abandoned. Remember how I came to your side, lifted you up, and showed you the depth of my love, a love I have continued to demonstrate ever since. Therefore, I urge you not to harbor doubts now, especially when you are on the brink of realizing so many of your dreams. This is not the time to falter or let skepticism cloud your mind. Past hardships occurred when you rushed ahead without thoughtful consideration, without reflection, and without seeking my guidance. You may have felt driven to distance yourself from me, yet I have never left your side. This is why I implore you once more, entrust all your worries to me. Let your soul find rest and serenity today. I infuse your heart with courage, empowering you to go where you must, speak to whom you must, and advocate for what you need. I am with you every step of the way. Your dreams are within reach. I am your almighty God, and with me, you truly have everything, beloved child. The miracle you seek is already unfolding. Believe with all your heart. Recall those moments when all seemed lost, when your senses whispered that the end was near. In those times, did not my spirit whisper of my unyielding purpose for you? You were not made for defeat. Victory is woven into your very being, yet. I call you closer to seek and know me deeper than before. In this world, none can match the purity and vastness of my love. Many struggle to grasp its depth and choose instead to turn away, embracing doubt. They cannot fathom that they too are dearly loved. And in their disbelief, they spread the lonely creed that no God cares as I do. But here I am, arms wide open, ready to embrace and heal your battle-weary heart that so many yearn for, and which sometimes weeps in solitude. Your intentions shine bright and true. It is my joy to fulfill the noble desires of your heart for your loved ones. Fear not the snares of debt or bondage, for the blessings I bestow are freely given, meant to be shared with others to uplift your family, and not to be hoarded. Unshared blessings wither. Let them flow freely in the river of life and hinder not your own prosperity. I am the God of generosity, of those who give, share, and support. I am your sustainer. The blessings I pour upon you will multiply, and you shall want for nothing. I decree an end to your struggles. When the world weighs heavy upon you, I nourish your soul daily with words of faith, hope, and love. These are not mere words to be spoken lightly, but are the seeds of eternal life. Hold them close, and they will empower you to conquer, to face adversaries without fear. You and your descendants shall know no lack, nor will they ever be left wanting or defeated. My beloved child, I'm endowing you with a profound sensitivity to grasp the extraordinary power of my Holy Spirit. This touch upon your soul is not merely for comfort, it is an empowerment, granting you strength and self-discipline to rise, labor, contend, and prevail. Those who oppose you will retreat in trepidation, and no circumstance will instill fear in you. 
Your character is resilient, fortified by my ever-present strength. I have transformed your sorrow into joy, dispelled your despair, and awakened you to your profound purpose. You are truly exceptional. Those from your past who witness your transformation cannot deny that with each passing day, you reflect more of my likeness. I have bestowed upon you a divine anointing that rejuvenates your spirit. Doors will open for you wherever you tread. Ask of me, and I will lavish you with gifts, not for hoarding, but for generous sharing. Pass on these blessings to everyone you meet, needy or not, for in giving, you will receive abundantly. Adopt my perspective. When I promise to shower blessings upon you, envision more than mere material wealth, silver, gold, or fleeting treasures. Think of the riches of eternal life, full and overflowing. For those who earnestly seek me will find all other things provided for them. Delve into my word and learn from its teachings. Observe that behind every miracle stood someone with genuine faith. Their gratitude for blessings yet unseen was the kindling for their ever-growing faith. They witnessed wonders, parted seas, vanquished foes, enriched the needy, healed the ailing, and endured trials and persecutions with grace, without complaint. This same spirit that empowered them to persevere dwells within you today. Embrace it and let it guide your path, my cherished child. You commune with no mere figment, but with the God of all reality. In my presence, uh, you find a haven of love, forgiveness, and healing. A place of wisdom, patience, serenity, and profound intelligence. I hold your future, your answers, your pathways, and your solutions securely within my grasp. Draw near to me. I invite you to delve deeper into the reality of my divine power, to become a vessel through which my kingdom comes and my will is done within your life and home. You approach me with love, not turning away. You listen as I speak, waiting patiently until I have imparted all I wish to say. Then you open your heart in prayer, sharing your words and tears with me. Such is your true and effective prayer. My doors stand open to you. Ask what you will. I know your heart seeks only what is noble, holy, and good, shunning the empty allure of material things. Your bond with me and the vitality of your spiritual life are your treasures. As your soul flourishes, so too will all aspects of your life. I will keep bestowing profound blessings upon your family as I have always done. I grant you the patience to await the unfolding of miracles I begin today. Expect the unexpected, for good news will soon arrive at your doorstep, bringing peace and reassurance, proving I have never deceived you nor overpromised. When I vowed to bless you, it was out of my deep desire, capability, and steadfast will. Remember, your future hinges not on people or wealth. While the world spins into chaos and complexity, my love remains steadfastly with you. For you have embraced my words, heeded my advice, followed my guidance, and observed my commandments. You have stored up in your heart the precious lessons I impart each day. Join me in joy each morning at sunrise, and on days when the sun seems obscured by clouds, know that the radiance of my glory continues to brighten your heart. Do not confine yourself nor succumb to fear from the events that swirl around you. Even a day shrouded in clouds carries its blessings. Hear this assurance I inscribe lovingly upon your spirit. Fear not, for I am ever with you. Those who fixate on material possessions and visible troubles tend to be consumed by pessimism and negativity, clouding their spiritual vision and leading them astray. They may begin with a spirit ready to conquer all, yet falter when they shift their trust from my promises to the hollow words of the world. They have placed their trust in fleeting companions, valued the opinions of others over mine, and ignored my assurances that their future rests securely in my hands. I desire not for your mind to be burdened with thoughts that corrode your spirit. Instead, 
Focus more on nurturing your soul and mind. Feasting upon my holy word that heals, builds up, strengthens, and sustains you. Know this deeply. I love you. Within this unending love are anchored all the promises made to you. Thus, I remain steadfast. Center your life on this truth. I seek your well-being and your blessing. It is my desire to see your family liberated from any bondage, healthy, employed in dignified work, benefiting from enriching education, and buoyed by a firm hope for a brighter future for you and your descendants. You shall fulfill dreams and desires, and in those beautiful moments, they will receive from my hands the rewards for their faith and determination. You are kind and sincere. At times, you may feel your dreams are modest and your desires few, but today, I want you to understand that I have sown a magnificent vision within your heart. I'm entrusting you and your family with a powerful mission. You will stand with bravery and proclaim to the world that your God is good, filled with abundant love and forgiveness for all who seek me with sincerity, repentance, and a heart ready to be transformed. You will be a hero of faith, called to perform wonders and miracles, to extend your hands to provide food, clothing, and medicine to those in need. My cherished one, I see how the promises I've made stir your spirit. The day you chose to seek me, you could not have envisioned the immense blessings I plan to instill within you. The calling to carry my word, the renewal of your life's purpose, and the supernatural experiences soon to unfold are merely the dawn of extraordinary wonders that will manifest in you and your family.